I'm here with Andrew from Left Coast. Um, so Andrew, I see this product called Turpinator. What does this product do? Uh, Turpinator? Basically what the name's referring to is terpenes. Terpenes, there's about 200,000 of them that have been identified in the plant world. There's about, uh, they're basically responsible for all smells, all flavors, resin content. Um, you know, when you smell a pine tree, what you're actually smelling is alpha pine it's a terpene. When you're smelling like a citrus tree, what you're smelling is limonene, it's a terpene. Okay. Linalool is the one in lavender. So basically, the, your plants are going to be producing these smells anyways. What this does is actually increases the amount of them and the concentration of them. So when would I want to start using this product? Um, there's a couple different ways you can use the Terpinator. One of the ways that you might want to use it is uh, when you run it during veg, you want to do it about 7 to 10 days before you're going to be going into flowering. Run it about 10 milliliters per gallon or 2.5 milliliters per liter for my Canadian friends. <laughs> and uh, basically what, what happens then is you get it into the cellular tissue of the plant. So when you do flip into flowering, it's going to already be there. And when you start gland production, it's going to actually physically produce, the, physically increase the amount of glands that you're going to produce. So that's kind of why you want to run it during veg. When you're running it through flowering, I recommend about 15, 20 milliliters per gallon. Um, and then when you get to weeks four and six, I like to spike it up, maybe 25, 30 milliliters okay. per gallon. Yep. And then you can it's totally safe to run all the way through flower. And uh, you can also, you can cut it out a week before if you want to do that, make sure. But um, it's totally safe to run all the way through. Excellent. Awesome. Yeah.